A Rover Story, Chapter 27, The Last Night. How do you feel on like the last night before you do something special? Like school is about to start again. It is August 1st to be exact. School is about to start again. So, you know, that, that night before school starts when you can't sleep and you're like awake and anxious and excited and nervous. Imagine how Rez feels. Even though Journey tells Rez not to feel. Make a connection here. How does that feel? On the last night before launch, Xander plays music for me. Perhaps he is playing the music for himself, but I like to think he's also playing it for me. Xander tells me about every song. This is the song I slow dance to in eighth grade, he says before he plays the song. I do not know what it means to slow dance or what eighth grade is, but I like the song. It is slow and steady. He selects another song. This was the song I would listen to in college before a big exam. The song is not calming. It is one of those songs with lots of crashing noises. It is a song that demands you pay attention to it. Lastly, Xander turns on one more song. And this is the song I listened to when I first found out I was going to get to work here. Now, this song I really like. It has a steady rhythm. If I currently had freedom of movement, I would like to rove around in a pattern while listening to the song. This is a song I wish I could take with me to Mars. I do not know if Mars will have songs, but I would like it very much if Mars did. When Xander finally leaves, I think the lab is empty, except for us robots. But then Raina walks into the room. She sits in the corner, typing on her tablet for a little while. Her breathing is more unsteady than usual. I don't know why I'm nervous, she says. I look around. I do not see another hazmat in the room. And I have 23 different cameras. If there was another hazmat, I would definitely see them. Are you talking to me, I say, even though I know she can't hear me. She is talking to you, her tablet says. She is not talking to me. Are you sure, I say. The tablet does not respond. He goes back to being productive. It's foolish of me to talk to you, right, she says, but I can't help it. This is your last night here and I know Xander plays songs for you, and so I want to play one for you, too, so that you will remember me. She stops talking. She shakes her head. This is so ridiculous. No, it's not, I say. I like when you talk to me. She shakes her head again. Okay, I'm going to play you this song, even though... I feel absurd, absurd that I'm talking to you because that means I'm really talking to myself, right? No, you are talking to me, I say. This is a song from my childhood, she explains. I hope it will bring you luck on your mission. Raina plays the song. The song is in Arabic. It sounds like a smile feels. I wish so badly that I could tell her that I appreciate it. I listen as carefully as I can. I try to memorize it. I am equipped with a great memory, but even still, I worry that I will forget it somehow. I very much do not want to forget this moment. Thank you, Raina. I say, I will listen to the memory of that song on Mars. Once the song is over, Raina turns out the light in the room. I know she is leaving for the night, that this is it. I sit in the dark quiet of the room. I do not know how to say goodbye.